G'day, this is my SIM 1 that was uh, kindly given to me by Jonathan. It came with 1K of RAM, which I've now upgraded to 4K. The original 1K no longer functioned, and so after scouring through my parts bins, I've managed to find enough uh, 2114s so I can have 4K installed. And what I've done, I've burnt BASIC onto two EPROMs, and these are 2732s, and that requires changing three of the uh, lines around for the 2732s to match the original 2532 MAS ROMs, and this is the jumper configuration that I finally um, worked my way through, and now that that's working, we're going to remove this uh, set of cables that I was using across the jumpers just for troubleshooting. Okay, let's just power it on. Okay, it's powered on. Press reset. Okay, go over to our terminal, which we're currently running at 4800. I'm going to hit Q. Okay, and now I'm going to go J0. And there we go. We've got basic running. Okay, this is absolutely fantastic. Okay. Just run that, and there we go. This is my Freedom 100 serial terminal, and it's running Sim Basic at 4800 board. And there's the serial cable running into the Sim 1. So now that we've actually got Basic running, we're going to uh, clean up these jumpers, and we still have one free socket. Left, so we may add another EEPROM, um, maybe with an assembler, or we're going to think about that. But I'm not quite sure, but I'm just happy to have it working with BASIC. So we're going to clean all this up. And this is a great little machine and a wonderful piece of history. And it's really lovely to see it running uh, good old BASIC. Okay, thanks for watching. Um, got any questions or any comments? Uh, yeah, post them below. Okay, cheers. Thanks for watching.